Hello guys, it's Cody. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to fix the shortcuts broken by uh, iOS updates. So after each update, I find some shortcuts are not working. Uh, it's probably some of the variables. Uh, it's no longer valid. So for example, uh, this shortcut, you see the this year, uh, the color is, is lighter and and uh, this is certainly not right. So let's just fix this shortcut invert image color. Uh, let me just, uh, you see the convert image to PNG. So this, let's select the magical variable and select the selected photos to PNG the convert and the encode. Encode should be the uh, above action so should should, should encode this uh, converted image and get the width and get the photo. You see the get photos action, this is a uh, uh, actually not required since this is pretty probably uh cr this shortcut was uh probably created on ios 12 i think so let me just delete this uh get photos this is a get the width and it's converted image and uh, okay you see uh base 64 encoded that's correct code input input should be this should be this Should be this text URL get the content of web page. So this URL, I cannot select the magical variable. Okay. So all uh, this is right. Get content of the web page and URL, this URL, and the get image from input. Select magic variable, this content of web page. Show in quick look, give you a quick review, preview the image. Save to photos, should save this. Uh, should save the image. Get image from the contents should be this image. Share option is put it's uh, don't think it's uh, really needed. So let me just uh, run this shortcut to see if it works. Just try this one. I have uh, updated to iOS 15 beta. You you already should take this long.
Let me try another. This is probably a bug. Just uh, change the image background. This should work fine. Let me do this one. The file type, let me just uh, fix it. Receive file, let me just add a convert image. PNG, right? Preserve metadata is not needed. Just set variable to photos to the set a variable to this uh, converted image. is not needed this nest and one select photos select photos uh, here should uh, Select photos, we should have and a converted image as well, or we can just uh, drag this down. Let's just delete this one. Let's do this to make it simpler. And this API key, let's just uh, trade down. And if and let's set a wearable done as well. Set a wearable uh, below the and if. And here we should add a convert so convert the if result to PNG and preserve metadata toggle off. So select this set wearable photos to convert image. PI key image file photo. Okay, let's uh, that should be it. We just run it. 
no image given. Oh, some, something is wrong. Let me check. Has value. So this should be does not have value. So select photos and oh, let me just try again. So here you can select photo, right? File to large. Exceed twelve megabytes. Well, so let me just make this shortcut a better one. So check the size how about And if if file size is now zero or equal to twelve megabytes resize. Resize converted image. You can say that the, uh, the parameters, otherwise, and if so, to work over to this, and if result should be. Should be this and if result. You mean another set of variable? Photo, right? Check. Small case. Oh, let me just change this one to photo. Okay. So let's just run it in. This one. It should have been. So resize the photo you see here. Step down. Oh, I can save the photos or select background. Select background. Uh, let me just uh, select the. Just select this one. So we can drag it and uh, enlarge it or zoom it and uh, turn it upside down. Do you want? 
I need to change the opacity here. Okay, let's step down. Always allow. You see here? We have fixed the uh, change the image background shortcut. Get current data. That's not necessary. Let me just do this one. Okay, let's just save this shortcut. Okay, that's pretty much it for this video to uh, fix broken shortcuts. Well, some, uh, some, uh, something. This uh, sometimes it's the system bug uh, that you can not fix, and sometimes it's the. Uh, It's uh, because uh, because the EOS are third third party uh, of for example this one it was the third party service and sometimes the third party service is broken and in that case you cannot fix or the third party has changed some parameters and then you should change it too. So this is just uh, fix some of the variables uh, invalid because the system updates. Hope you, hope you find this helpful. As always, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one.